impact in relation to uh, how people can use this for benefiting themselves, say their own business, there might be small business people, or they might have particular issues around work or thinking about uh, changing their career? Well, the, the, way, the way that I would I'd use it myself is in my goal setting work, and essentially it's, it's sitting, sitting quietly, uh, and what I, the way I would describe it is, is doing a Reiki session for myself with, with a particular goal written down in front of me. So it's focusing my mind on that particular goal, and the way that Reiki works is, is using symbols to empower something. Mm -hmm. So that if you've got, got a particular objective in mind, and you use those symbols, then it's a way, of, a way of heightening that particular part of your mind, if you like, or it's a way of shining a spotlight on that particular bit so that you don't forget about it. Yeah. So just a way of imprinting it on your mind. Okay. Now, for, for listeners that are not Reiki practitioners, they obviously don't or won't have access or knowledge on how to use the symbols that we use in Reiki. How do you think they can actually do something similar uh, without using those symbols? You for actually, themselves. Yeah, the, the equivalent thing on the outside would be um, writing down a list of goals and then highlighting it with a pen. Use a highlighter pen. Mm -hmm. That's kind of the equivalent thing of what's going on on the inside with a Reiki symbol. Use a different colored pen for different types of goals. Mm -hmm. and, and draw rings around them or, hi or really make things stand out. Because that, mm -hmm. that's the equivalent of what a, re of a, a Reiki symbol would do. Yeah, I use um, goal setting and visualisation um, with people that um, are not actually attuned and I find that drawing diagrams um, of what they, they are seeking to attract helps them focus on, on that particular goal. Absolutely, the, the, there's a, the law of attraction kicks in and, and we start to attract the things that we're thinking about. Right, law of attraction, you're touching on that, that's something I'm very interested in at the moment, and I feel that that also is uh, coming from the same source of energy as the Reiki energy. I agree with that, certainly.